Here are two bikes that you vintage dirt bike enthusiasts might be interested in. The first one we're looking at here is a Bridgestone 1967 SR100. This is a production racing motorcycle and I, I restored this some years ago uh, to standard spec so it looks just like one that came from the factory. It is one that came from the factory. Bridgestone took a lot of uh, standard production parts, modified some of them, combined you know models together to come up with some like the gas tank is from a Sport 60 and the frame is uh, probably from a deluxe 100 or 90 and the engine is at 100 cc's it's been modified they increased the uh, output from about 10 horsepower to about 15 horsepower and on this side you can see some of the special parts they made for the racer the, uh, the whole side, this whole side of the engine is made of uh, uh, special sand castings, one to cover the, uh, the larger racing carburetor and provide some uh, rudimentary air, air cleaning and the clutch cover. Those are all special parts. But a lot of other parts are standard like the Kickstarter and the, the body. You can see that they, they took the, the frame and, and shortened the rear fender. But the shocks look standard to me, and the wheels, and the side cover, the battery goes under that side cover. These had a, a constant loss of battery ignition, and the battery is under that cover. The forks, pretty standard Bridgestone of that era, and the front wheel, same. They came ready to race with the number plate and the, you know the high fenders and the whole nine yards. I just added the lettering to the number plate. On this side, you can see the expansion chamber the factory built and installed on these bikes. The seat is a special item just just for the racers. This one we have here is one I just finished restoring. It's a, a Vantech racing frame made by a company in California about that time, 1967. And uh, the engine you see and some of the, in the running gear, the wheels and the forks uh, are, are just the same as the ones on the bike we just looked at. Same SR100 engine. The tank is a Van Tech item made that go with these kit frames. They sold the frames as a kit with a, a sort of a unique engine mounting system that was adaptable to many different engines. So you could get a kit that fit the Bridgestone or you could get a kit that fit uh, YL1 Yamaha or probably a YL2 Yamaha or you know Suzuki engines. I think the most common engine in these, these frames is probably Hodaka's. But they, they made a setup for the Bridgestone, and here it is. Uh, these engine plates I made myself. They're not the same as the stock kit. And the battery box is something I made myself, too. I tried to incorporate as much Bridgestone stuff into this bike as I could, but it didn't come with it, because I'm a you know Bridgestone fan. So the fenders are both uh, TMX. Bridgestone items, that one of their little trail bikes. The seat is a TMX seat that I've highly modified to make it look a little more like an SR seat. But the wheels are the same as the wheels you on this other bike. They're pretty standard Bridgestone. They had slightly wider rims to uh, manage the bigger tires. The uh, the. Bantech kits didn't come with an exhaust system, at least for, for the Bridgestone, and so, so they were all, you know, custom made. And this one was made by a, uh, a fellow here in San Diego, Sal Peluso, did a great job on that, on that expansion chamber with a little muffler built on the end.
There's the TMX stainless steel front fender. A lot of the this tank looks really good now, but a lot of them, uh, you know, in used condition were all beat up. This particular one was uh, was uh, straightened out by a friend of mine, uh, Rob North, who's a metal master here in San Diego, who built his own motorcycles around the uh, the uh, BSA and Triumph triples. Foot pegs are also Bridgestone items from a 175. The rear shocks are also from Bridgestone 175. That's the TMX rear fender, also stainless steel. Bars and controls on both the bikes are standard Bridgestone items adapted to the, uh, the SR100 racing setup. Painter in San Diego County who does a lot of motorcycle painting is Blake Conway and did painted my motorcycle tank here, the, the Vantech tank. I painted it in the same color as the Bridgestone just for continuity. Left the sides unpolished but unfinished. watching.